Hello and welcome to a new video about digital technology. We're talking about, well, logic. Yeah? We're talking about logic. We have talked about uh, Boolean algebra and so on. We talked about what the logic circuit, logic, logic base elements are. And today I want to talk about uh, the, the Morgan's law. Okay? Augustus de Morgan was a an, an British uh, mathematician and he discovered the following thing. Um, it's logic. Yeah? Let's compare two table of truth. Okay? So let's compare from this symbol Okay, so we have here an x1, here we have an x2, and here we have a y. Okay. The logic equation would be y equals hello <laughs> x1 and x2 not all right this is the logic equation now let's write down the table of truth x1 x2 y we have 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, ah, 0, 0, 1, 1. This would be correct. Okay, so and, the and would be only the last one. Yeah, only the last one would be and. Yeah? And, not, exactly not that, so this means the last one is 0, and we have 1, 1, 1. This is the table of truth of this element. Okay, now let's have a look on another element. This time I am going to draw an OR. And this time I am going to not the inputs. X1, X2, Y. So actually Y equals x1 and not x1 or not x2 okay let's write down again the table of truth x1 x2 y This time I'm going to write it correct. 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1. Okay. So let's see. If what this actually means if at least one of those two signals is not there, then it's one. So yeah, here, 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 and here both are here, so no. Papa! It's exactly the same. It's exactly the same. So and an AND with a NOT at the output is exactly the same like an OR and a NOT at the input. Okay, So these two things are exactly the same. Three uh, in, all, in all beauty. Yeah? In every aspect they are the same. This is the rule of De Morgan. Okay, and now let's have also a look on what is happening with an NOR element. Let's think about this. So, Y actually equals x1 
or x2 and not. Okay. So let's keep this x1, x2, y, table of truths. So let's write it down. Zero one zero one zero zero one one. So the or would be the last three. At least one of them must be there. And not exactly not that means only the first one. This is the table of truth of this. And now I make an end. Make these little rings at the beginning. All right. So we have again y. We have x1, x2, and we have y equals not x1 and not x2. Table truth. Zero one zero one zero zero one one. So it's both must not be there, yeah. Not this and not this. So this is one, yeah, and these are zeros. Also the same. They are exactly the same. Yeah. So whenever you you change from an or to an and, you have to turn around all in and outputs. Yeah? That's actually it. Yeah? That's actually it. Yeah? Because act it, it doesn't really matter if, if you can even you can even you you simply have to exchange all knots. At the at the in and output, okay, then it's working. So, if we have here, for instance, uh, x one and x two and x three and and so on, and then we have somewhere an x n and and we make this a knot. We this is exactly the same as not x1 or not x2 or not x3 or and so on, or not xn. That's it. Yeah? And also the other way around, x1 or x2 or x3 or and so on, or xn not is exactly the same in every matter x1 not x1 and not x2 and not x3 and and so on and not xn go away i'm really glad i started with the different colors because this makes it <laughs> it looks good, nice yeah but for writing it's not that nice that's the morgan's law okay finish yeah. it's working every time and can be used to simplify logic circuits. Okay. How 
to derive logic circuits now from any table of truth, uh, we will learn in next video. Okay? Because you said, okay, we can simplify logic circuit, but how to get the logic circuit? Yeah? We, will, we will discuss in next video. For this time, thank you very much for listening. Goodbye.